Hey everybody, so my Productions here, and today we're going to be taking a look at the LEGO Titanic for one final time before it is un it will be unfortunately scrapped to make other builds. So before the video begins, I just want you to pause the video and give a moment of silence for this model. So, moving right along, here we have... So... About a while back, I issued a set of upgrades that can turn this model into the wreck of the Titanic. But here with me, I actually have another set of upgrades where you can take this model and transform it into its sister ships, the RMS Olympic and HMHS Britannic. So I think we should cover the Britannic. I'm going to cover the Britannic first because, I, because well, it's like the Titanic. This one sank, and also because the way to transform this ship into the Olympic is going to be a bit time consuming. So to transform the this model into the HMHS Britannic, it is quite simple. What you got to do is you just got to take this these cranes. You just got to take these pieces right here. These are hinges, and these are supposed to represent those big electric davits that the Britannic had. I'm only going to put two on just to demonstrate. Actually, I'll just, well, so this is how you're going to want. I'm only going to do one side just to demonstrate. Okay. You just do that. There we go. There we go. And that is how you're going to want to have that looking. Now, moving on to the stern of the model, it is quite simple. All you gotta do is just peel these tiles off. There you go. And then just place this over it. And there we have the Lego HMHS Britannic. And then, now, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna transform this back into to con convert it back to the Titanic, so that way I can show off how to convert it into the Olympic. And so I, you can display this in whatever, in whichever one you, you so choose. You can display it as the Olympic or as the Britannic. Me personally, I'm going to display this as the Titanic because it is arguably the most famous one out of all of them. All right, so now that this has been converted back to the Titanic, so what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to take off the first, the front two funnels, the first two funnels. Work here. Okay, now you're gonna want to take off the bridge, remove the wing cabs, take this right here, just take that off, take that off, and then just take this off here. <sighs> That is actually the hardest time that I have had pulling that section off. Now, we're going we're gonna to start removing some layers here. So you're going to want to remove this section here. Take this section right here. Remove it. You know, I'm only going to be working on the A-deck promenade because if you've seen images of the Olympic, it is basically the same ship as the Titanic. The only difference is the promenade deck on a the promenade on a deck look has a different appearance you know, so just remove all of this and that is all of the stuff that you're going to want to remove then you're going to take these well 
I'm gonna put it. Then I'm gonna take these two sections right here, set them off to the side. Take a one by four tile, place it there. I'm gonna do the same thing on the other side. There we go. And now for the A deck promenade. And I'm gonna just and then you're gonna wanna insert this piece right here. Go. Just insert that. Oh, oh wait, wrong piece. Wrong piece. Wrong piece. That is the wrong piece. What you're really gonna wanna put on there is this piece right here. And that'll just go right there. And I dropped a few things. There we go. And then this, you don't need this anymore. You just set that off to the side. There you go. So let's change the promenade on this one. Now we can start putting everything back together. I'm pretty sure if Historic Travels just ends up like seeing this model, he might display his as the Olympic or Titanic. There you go. There you go. Now just put all this back together. go and then just put every you just, now once you have changed the promenade like you have seen demonstrated in this video you can just put everything back on where it was and there we go we have the lego titanic model that has just been converted to the lego rms olympic and it looks good very faithful to the very faithful to photographs and I don't know if there was any like actual live footage taken of the Olympic. I I know there must be some live footage taken of the Olympic cuz I mean we know what the whistle sounded like. So that was the Lego RMS Olympic and HMHS Britannic upgrade kits for the Lego RMS Titanic and I will see you in the next video which I will be reviewing G1 Astrotrain.